Hello everyone! It is a very early morning for me and I need coffee. Like lots and lots of coffee. Like so much coffee, I want to fill this entire pond with it. Steamy, hot, fresh coffee. In order to make that happen, I need to clear out this land, make it all nice and smooth, and put down some flooring. Because we are gonna make a coffee factory. Flooring going down. Oh, it's the Wednesday Feast. Ah, uh, who cares? There we go, we have a nice smooth area to work with. And the awesome part is, is we got this mod that makes little coffee makers. Isn't it cute? I just have to put like a hundred more down. It's actually not that hard to do. Okay, so I put like 430 of these down. That's a lot more than a hundred. I hope this is enough. If not, I can make more. We're gonna be farming the rest of this land here and also the giant field that we played with last time. Putting a couple chests down so they will collect the beans and the coffee. Probably don't need this many, but I definitely want to make sure everything is covered. We will be harvesting quite a lot of beans. Now that we're done with that, we don't need these anymore. Now if this works properly, we should be able to throw these beans in and they should come back with a uh, coffee. Like everything is working nicely. I think the time being frozen has effect on these. So let's unfreeze time for a minute. <laughs> Look at all of them brewing. Aren't they cute? They're brewing little cups of coffee. So adorable. I can't wait. So I think they all just collected. There we go. Nice. So for every 999 beans, we get 199 cups of coffee. I'm gonna love this idea. So I went through and I skipped a lot of the BS so I could get one of these clocks so I won't have debris on the farm. I kind of want to spend all of my money and go completely broke with this so I can get a good number at the end of how much I earn. I wonder what I can purchase. Let's go find out. When I thought about it, the simplest answer is always the best answer. How many of these do I need? As many as I can afford. And I'll destroy them until I have no money left. Pretty sure currently Pierre has the most things to go broke with. So let's buy a bunch of catalogs. Apparently we can buy several of them. Oh, almost there. We need to buy more things. Getting closer. $92. There's nothing else I can buy here. So I think we're just about broke. Tomorrow starts our coffee day and I'm so excited. It's the first day of spring. Oh God, Kent, go away. Whatever. Go oh, away, I don't want to talk to you. As I was saying, it's the first day of spring. And we gotta hoe all this, plant all our coffee. This is gonna be a fun time. So this little area was already hoed. I think it stayed permanently hoed. Let's go check out the Grampleton area. Oh my gosh, this entire area stayed hoed. A good portion of my work was already done, which is super awesome. I can't wait to plant all my coffee here. It's time to put all these beautiful beans, these wonderful, delicious, lovely beans into the dirt. Let's go. And I'm just finishing up this last little area. Possible inch needs to be filled with coffee. And now it's time to hoe the rest of this place. And I'm gonna try doing it here too. I know last time we had some trouble, but hopefully since I have the ability to not have debris grow, it won't happen again. And don't forget the little secret area down here. Let's throw the beans in now. There we go. So that's all laid out. Let's keep going. And we'll get to the other little secret areas. Get them all nice and planted. And everything is dug. But obviously we need to get rid of this garbage. This is not coffee. This is not coffee. This is unacceptable. Coffee only. Thank you. Let's get some more of those beautiful beans. I won't need any more than that, but I would love to have as many as possible. Let's get these beautiful beans planted. And every last bean is planted. Now I just have to water these every day and harvest these every two days for the next two months. This is gonna be fun. I can't wait. So much coffee. So much delicious coffee. Aren't the cute little plants adorable? Look at these little guys. In just a couple more days. Hey, crow, get out of here. These are my coffee beans. Where did he steal one? Aw, poor little guy. Gone. It's such a sad time. Oh well, we have plenty more. Time to go back to sleep. Welcome to this amazing world of coffee. I can't wait to pick all these beans. Now it's time to get on this tractor and harvest them all. Yeah, this is gonna take a lot less time to do. But it's such a beautiful thing. Look at all these beans. And we have to get these guys every single time, which is gonna be kind of a pain in the butt, but it's worth it. 
Look at them shake. They're adorable. Now let's go get the rest of our fields. That's amazing. Truly amazing. I might want to shrink the radius just a little bit because there is quite a bit of lag. But at the same time, it's so fun. And I've already just filled my inventory, so now we have to go back and unload. So let's get these unloaded. I'm already experiencing a lot of lag. I might break this game with just coffee. It was working fine earlier. Oh gosh, the lag is unreal. Let's try going into the house. There we go. Also, let's stop the time freeze. Maybe that'll help. I don't know. We'll try. I have a feeling this farm is going to be off limits when coffee is in production. Let's get out of here. We still have tons more to harvest, so let's get to it. That was easy. And then finally, Grampleton. <sighs> that was truly terrible and amazing at the same time. After today, I'm gonna lower that range because this is, this is hurting. Okay, so I ran out of room. Also, the game is beyond laggy, but we're gonna need to make more room. So we need to get to that chest that's on the other side. Hopefully we can get there without crashing the game. I feel like we should stop harvesting as well. Come on, come on, you can do it. I finally got here and slowly and painfully and putting everything away. Let's get back on our tractor. Try to harvest up all these extra beans that are just floating around. There's a lot of them. So I found picking up all these beans makes me go faster. So I'll just slow down the harvest just a little bit. Let's go down to harvesting at speed three. Let's see if we can get the rest of this going. Yeah, that's gonna be fun. Every two days doing this. It's all for the best thing in the world. The coffee tornado that is growing. I love it. And I ran out of inventory space again. Seems like we're starting to catch up. I had to freeze time though, because there was just way, way too many beans to harvest and not enough time to harvest them. Time to unload again. This is really so satisfying. Okay, so I think I actually got everything. I'm going to move my speed up just so that I can run through this really quickly to make sure I wasn't missing a single bean. Every single bean is important in this world no matter how long it takes to harvest. But I think we did pretty good. I think we got them all. So now I have to unload this and venture back to the farm. I think I might take out half of these coffee makers because it's just not gonna work if I can't move. Which means I can fill the rest in with beans. So let's get rid of a bunch of these. movement speed now it's a little bit better that's easy enough and the game is actually playable right now which i am super happy about and obviously we got to turn this into more coffee Ta -da! easy enough i was running out of time hopefully tomorrow will be more successful okay so we're back i changed the range on my tractor so hopefully it won't get too crazy but we still have a lot of work to do and this weather is lovely. All right, the first place is cleared out. We're going to unload these. We'll unload as many as we can. Let's go get the other places now. We'll get the little one and we'll get the big one. I love my tornado. After a few rounds, I ran out of room in these chests, so I had to put some more down. So hopefully they can catch up. Days later in the game, and I realize this is the stupidest idea I've ever had. This takes forever to do, and each day is painfully laggy. But I have so much coffee, I don't even know what to do with it all. I'll keep going. For the sake of coffee. But I'm not happy with the process. I ran out of room again. I'm not making enough coffee, but if I put any more coffee makers down, it will lag up the game to where I can't play anymore. So I'm gonna put some more coffee makers in the shed and in the cave, and hopefully that'll catch us up. Here's our lovely shed. We can fit quite a few coffee makers in here, and it shouldn't lag the game because it will be in a different area. So I'm gonna start filling this place with all these coffee makers, and it should help out. I think this is a very lovely looking room. We're gonna add our coffee beans in here and hopefully we don't die in the process. Looks like everything is running super great. Awesome. 
There we go. It's so beautiful. Now, off to the cave. Here is the hidden cave full of stupid mushrooms. But it doesn't matter. I'm gonna fill this with coffee makers. This shall be fun. And since I don't want to collect a bunch of stupid little mushrooms, I'm going to make sure I have space around that so that Automate doesn't grab these. I think that's enough. Let's put some chests in here and then we'll load her up. And thanks to another wonderful mod, I can go to the farm and pull out all of these and put them in the cave. All right, there you have it. Another 400 coffee makers making my coffee and it should catch up now so we won't have any issues. So today is the last day and unfortunately I forgot to water these so they didn't grow. Also neither did these and I'm not gonna grow these things because this has been a very long and painful experience and I just want to get these sold and make my money. Okay so on the farm we have a chest with two beans. Just making sure there's no chest with any beans in it. We have quite a few going on here. Ooh, we have plenty in here. I'm gonna take some of these out of here and we're gonna go check out the cave. And here we are at the cave. We have, ooh, several beans in here. So I'm gonna take out some of these and we'll put these back in this chest so we can finish making the rest of our coffee and get it sold. I just have these couple final beans. We can make one more cup of coffee and then that's it. But sadly, we have these three beans that won't turn into coffee. Oh well. Now we have to go through the grueling process of taking all of these coffees and putting them in the shipping bin. There's plenty of coffee in this shed, but I'm totally going to use the mod to transfer all the cups of coffee into the shipping bin. Here we are, finally, at the cave. We have lots of coffee here that we need to get rid of. I just have these final cup of coffees to go in here, and then we can sleep. And the final totals are here. That is a fun dancing number. I don't know what it is, but let's look. So, interesting fact, while I was doing all the math and counting, apparently in Stardew Valley you can have only 40 pages of inventory show up. I'm not sure about other types or something, but the math wasn't coming out right. In total, I should have 64 pages of coffee being sold. I made 86,609,550 dollars. That actually comes out to 64 pages of coffee, which is quite amazing because my whole total of cups of coffee is 575,424 cups. That's a lot of coffee. And just so you know how crazy I was getting that is almost 3 million beans harvested and I had a couple days where I messed up so it could have been more so yeah that's a lot of beans and that's a lot of coffee would I ever do this again hell no but do I still enjoy coffee yes I do